Hello friends, welcome to my YouTube channel Basic Electrical. Today we have discussed about the unsymmetrical series impedance. So in the unsymmetrical series impedance, you can see that there are the three phases that is IA, IB and IC. So across them the voltage is VA and across this voltage is VB. Okay. And across that voltage is VC. Okay. So this is the neutral current here, the neutral current IN is flowing, okay, uh, that is, is equal to sum of the current that is IA plus IB plus IC, as we know that in the previous Lee. So here across that there the voltage is, you have to consider is VA dash and this is the VB dash and the this is, is VC dash, okay. So here you can see that the impedance is that is ZS, you have considered that is ZS okay so this in ZS ZS and this is ZS so ZS is basically shows that that is the uh, series impedance okay so ZS is the series impedance okay and across that there is the mutual impedance that is here it is the mutual impedance between phase A and B that is ZM and this is the mutual impedance ZM that is phase uh, B and C ZM and this is the mutual impedance ZM that is between the phase A and phase C okay so here the ZS is the series impedance whereas the ZM represent the mm, mutual impedance of any line pair okay so uh, the following we have to consider the kvl in this uh, series impedance circuit is that so in the this we have to the following kvl apply kvl and the following kvl equations can be uh, written here okay so you can see that in this uh, that is here va and v va this one and the va dash so that is va minus va dash okay that is, is equal to z into zs and the phase is current is flowing that is ia plus z zm mutual impedance between them that is ib okay and uh, third is that the j z m i c okay so how we can write like that okay you can see here first of all we have to consider v a minus v a dash so here v v a and this one is the v a dash okay so according that the series impedance is z s and current is flowing i a so i have written z s into i a okay and according to that the second it is connected with the mutual impedance z m okay so i have considered the mutual impedance zm and connected with the phase b current ib so zm into ib and the similar way it is considered that the phase a zm is considered here the zm is mutual between phase c and a and current is ic so zm ic i have written okay the next is that how vb minus vb dash is equal to how you can write similar way that is z into z into zm ia mutual impedance between uh, a and between a okay plus z into zs ib okay plus z into zm ic similar way i have considered okay how we have considered you can see here vb and vb dash okay so here the current is flowing that is ib so ib into zs so here i have written ib into zs the next is it is connected with the mutual impedance with the phase a so mutual impedance with the phase a again it is connected with with the phase c with mutual impedance so phase c with mutual impedance ic so i have written now similar way you can write that is vc minus vc dash is equal to that is z into zm ia plus z into 
जेड एम आई बी प्लस जे इन टू जेड एस आई सी ओके सो हेयर यू कैन सी दैट सिमिलर वे वी सी माइनस वी सी डैस तो सो द करेंट इज फ्लोइंग आई सी इंटू जेड एस आई सी इंटू जेड एस द नेक्स्ट इज इट इज म्यूचुअल विद द फेज बी यू कैन सी इट इज म्यूचुअल विद द फेज बी हेयर यू कैन सी दैट इट इज म्यूचुअल विद द फेज फेज बी सो हेयर जेड एम इंटू आई बी अगेन इट इज म्यूचुअल विद द फेज ए सो हेयर जेड एम इंटू आई ए सो आई कैन राइट इन दिस मैट्रिक्स फॉर्म आई हैव रिटर्न राइट लाइक दैट इज वी ए वी बी सॉरी वी ए वी बी वी सी माइनस वी ए डैस वी बी डैस वी सी डैस ओके सो हेयर दैट इज ए एंड द इम्पोर्टेंस वैल्यू दैट इज सीरीज एंड म्यूचुअल इम्पोर्टेंस दैट इज जेड एस जेड एम जेड एम एंड दिस इज जेड एम जेड एस जेड एम एंड दिस इज जेड एम जेड एम एंड जेड एस ओके एंड द करेंट इज आई ए आई बी एंड आई सी ओके सो हेयर you can see that the what is here this is the form that is uh, vp minus vp dash is equal to this form that is z into ip okay so here uh, suppose that here the vs minus vs dash is equal to that is z into uh, is and multiply with the a okay so i have written vs minus vs dash that is equal to uh, a inverse z a i s okay so that is equation number 1 so how we calculate that is a inverse z a okay so a inverse z a first of all we have calculated a inverse z a so what is the value of a as we already know about the value of a a is here that is that is the value of a is uh, 1 1 1 1 alpha square alpha 1 alpha alpha square 1 i already uh, discuss about in the previous lecture of the uh, power system so i have written the value of a inverse directly so i a inverse is if you have any doubt regarding how to calculate this a inverse value and what is the value of a you can watch my previous video so i that is a inverse is 1 alpha alpha square that is 1 alpha 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 square alpha and this one 1 1 1 okay and the value of uh, z is j z s j z m j z m okay and uh, this one is j z m j z s j z m and this is j z m j z m and j z s okay and again uh, there is it is multiplication with the a so a is 1 1 1 1 alpha square alpha 1 alpha alpha square 1 okay so this one so a inverse z a what is when we will multiply this then we can get that is z and all the values is zero expect uh, diagonally that is z s minus z m this one is zero this one is zero this one is zero this one is zero and this one is zero and diagonal element zs minus zm and here that is zs plus 2 zm so this is the a inverse z a so now you can substitute these values in equation 1 so substitute in equation 1 okay so here for the phase suppose we have considered for the phase a so i have written for the phase a that is va1 positive negative and zero sequence and this one is uh, considered as subtraction of va dash v a2 dash and va0 dash so uh, this value is j zs minus zm 0 0 0 0 zs minus zm 0 Zero z s plus two z m, and it is multiplication with the 
your multiplication with the current that is IA1, IA2 and IA0. Okay. So now you have can get that is the VA1, VA2 and VA0. Okay. So VA1, VA2, VA0 minus VA1 dash VA2 dash VA0 dash is equal to that is Z1 0 0 0 Z2 0 0 0 Z3 and this one is IA1, IA2 and IA3 okay so z1 is equal to z zs minus zm and z2 is equal to here that is z zs minus zm when comparing this okay so i have we have write i have written this one is z1 and this one is z2 and this one is z3 so z1 z2 and z3 i have written so z3 is equal to that is j zs plus 2 zm okay so this one for the positive sequence impedance and this one is the negative sequence impedance and this one is the zero sequence impedance so the most important question for the uh, competi competition points of view or the examination points of view that is that uh, the for the positive sequence component is zs minus zm and negative sequence component is zs minus zm whereas the zero sequence component zs plus 2zm uh, 2zm so finally we have conclude that so finally uh, we conclude that a fully transposed transmission has that is first equal positive and negative sequence impedances second is that the zero sequence impedance much larger than the positive or negative sequence impedance and we can say that it is it is that it is approximately 2.5 times okay so that's important thing is that so it is approximately 2.5 five cents so uh, here you can see that uh, what is that what is happening in this so that is uh, that is the z1 impedance and this one is the z1 and v1 is there and this one is the v1 dash and the current i1 similar way for the negative sequence this one for the positive sequence network positive sequence network okay and the for the negative sequence same way that is z2 and i2 current flowing this one is the v2 v2 dash this is the negative sequence network and for the zero sequence that is z0 v0 v0 dash i0 so this is the zero sequence network okay so finally it has been observed that the sequence circuit is in decoupled form so there that is there is no mutual uh, sequence in inductance so it is also observed that the sequence circuit are in decoupled form that is there is 
no mutual sequence inductance okay inductance so how you can say that there is no mutual inductance is that so that is in is equal to ia plus ib plus ic okay so here in is equal to uh, that is the impedances in this uh, that is zs minus zm phase a and phase b that is zs minus zm whereas the phase c that is zs plus 2 zm okay so here you can see that zs plus zs plus zs and here minus 2 zm plus 2 zm okay so this one is cancel out so in is equal to 3 zs so here there is no mutual impedances okay so this is the important thing you should remember regarding that uh, what is that the two points are important that is first one is this one uh, that is the neutral in the neutral there is no mutual impedances is there and the second is that finally we can conclude that their equal positive and negative sequence and also the zero sequence impedance is much larger than the positive and negative sequence so here you can see that the positive negative and zero sequence are the impedances are this one zs minus zm zs minus zm and zs plus 2 zm so i hope you have to learn about this uh, so thank you very much please like and subscribe my channel basic electrical